Hey, welcome friends. So in this tutorial of SolidWorks, we are going to see that how can we use the construction line. The construction line can be used for complex geometry and it can make our work easy. So we are going for a new part. So in this video, we are just going to see how the construction lines can be used for complex geometry to make our work easy. So going for sketch, selecting the front view. So uh, we are going to make a complex geometry. So for that, uh, let's start with line. So now as you can see here, uh, our dimensions are not as per measurement and we also don't know the angles here. So as you can see uh, for this, suppose we want to make it angle 150, which is going to be changed and let's say it's 55 length, let's say this angle is 220 and the length is for this next angle is 3 and length is 5 so now as you can see for this the angle has been changed for this line so the angle has been changed for this line this is the same but for this it has been changed so i saw you that i saw that i show you that uh, you can use a fix command here and fix it but if you don't want to make it that the another way is to use a construction line for making the geometry so how to do that so going for new file and now going for sketch front view so we are making the same geometry now as you can see the first part this is 60 so we are going to make it 60 this is 25 now for this we have 150 37 so we have to go for lines here go for construction so we want 150 degree and 37 so lines for construction we are going to make an arbitrary one not as per the length and now we can change it <laughs> so now as you can see this length has been changed so what you have to do make it 60 this will be 25 and you can fix it if you want so that it is not going to be changed and this is 150 and 37 now we have this line which is 55 So this is the length is for this length 37. Now we want 55 horizontal line. Go here, go for construction. Okay. 
here at this length this time now this other line which is 25 angle is 20 Twenty-five, three forty, and now you can make horizontal line because you don't require construction and it is. It is not to be changed. So after making this, what you can do, you can use this solid line to make the actual geometry. So as you can see, we have done with uh, no, without any trouble, it is the construction line. So you can go for exit and now if you want to extrude it, you can extrude it and uh, that's pretty much for this video. So it is very helpful if you use the construction line for making complex geometry without any trouble. So thank you for watching the video.